is the definition of process software processes are different business processes are different and in general management processes are different like if you have to go from one place to another you went to jaipur so that was a process right you did some task mm-hmm. prior to achieve that and after achieve like after achieving your end goal so you got the process at what at what time at what uh, like you took some decisions so the, this is our general process definition so it depends on the mm-hmm. context the interviewer asked that what is a process right okay so this is it please go through this text Uh, software process is a set of activity associated outcome that produces a software product a process is a systematic way of executing task it is concerned uh, with the transformation of input and in, into output yeah okay uh, yeah uh, okay sir the first definition is inclined towards software development the second definition mm-hmm. is inclined to a general de- general management definition that what is a process right yeah now we understand what is a business process any idea uh, so uh, have a business process will be uh, so, suppose if we'll be uh, going uh, to perform a task so uh, what all uh, first of all what are tasks that we are going to uh, work on that and uh, what all uh, like the people that we are going to hire on that so everything uh, that will be required to complete that particular task be it uh, uh, like uh, the management skill or uh, the um, Uh, the other skills so everything will be included in that business process <clears throat> let me give you a one line crisp and clear definition and it will clear your clear your ambiguity in in the difference between a normal process and a business process a business process is very different from a normal process a normal process may or may not have business outcomes it may or okay. may do it might or it might not affect the business model or day to day operations of a business but mm-hmm. a business process is directly related to the performance of the business be okay. it be it hiring candidates be it selling your products being marketing be it uh, advertising be it uh, like mentorship be it training it is directly affecting your business business model basically either it can bring loss to your business either it can bring profits to your business in short term in long term but a business process is directly proportional and affects your business on a day to day basis business okay. process is repetitive in nature a normal process okay. can be executed at a certain time and it is a gen- it is general in nature it may or may not be repetitive but a business process is repetitive in nature for example okay. selling selling your products So if you have a software company and you have made a software for school management system an android application so your sales team will daily call the schools and the principals and the management and they expect you to uh, expect the school to buy your software so it is mm-hmm. a day to day operation in order to achieve the sales target so that your business gets profitable right okay. are you able to understand yeah so it always deals with metrics metrics means numbers either it can be with revenue either it can be with uh, seamless delivery either it can be with operation uh, operation means like day to day activities in a, in uh, in the business the clerical paperwork so it all depends on what you have to do that might affect your business plan on a day to day basis and it can affect your overall business on the long term so f- we have okay. three parameters here your business processes affects your business steps what you choose okay. what step or what series of processes you choose will affect your business executions on a day to day basis first thing it will affect your business goals if you choose a wrong process in order to execute something it can affect your business go- goal from profit to loss or loss to profit mm, okay it will directly affect your stakeholders because stakeholders are those those persons who are directly engaged with your business they can be customers they can be middlemen they can be any persons who is directly engaged to your business model i they can be your investor too if you go in loss your investor will also go in loss so we have to yeah. design those business processes in order to optimize your current process and achieve the goal in such a way that your business gets more and more prosperous day by day so what we are dealing with we are dealing with business process management 
so we understood what is a process we understood what is a business process and now we have to understood like now we have to understand what is business process management you know management is the art of getting things done through others so we'll be exploring yeah. uh, now what is business process management please go through this text first a business process a business method or a business function is collection of related structured activity or task by people or give 